is going on guys it's Wolf here welcome back to some more jurassic world last time we left off we actually made dr and thomas his uh his presence over here hopefully he doesn't hear us talking about us over here <laughs> anyways we made him his presence and of course we got him you know <clears throat> a computer a printer and a stereo as well as some ink and of course a lot of emeralds as well <clears throat> i wasn't talking about anything <clears throat> hopefully he wasn't hearing that anyways <laughs> god i can't i can't go down this ladder with this power suit anyways uh, is he still just hanging out over here? I guess he is. Huh, what do you know? <laughs> He's just still just uh, hanging out over here. I did get some comments saying, oh wait, no, never mind. Never mind, it seems like he can open these doors, no problem. Anyways, forget those comments. <laughs> I was about to say, like, uh, apparently he wasn't able to open it because there was like a carpet there, but I guess, I guess he just proved us wrong. Now, can you open up the birch doors? That'd be fantastic. Also got some comments saying that they weren't like opening and closing because they were, you know, they're not Minecraft doors, even though these are Minecraft doors. Birch, birch door, that's in Minecraft as far as I know. And uh, the reason why it says Malice's door is because like, it has this opening animation, so there you go. Anyways, uh, I also got a comment saying, hey, why don't, you should indeed get that, uh, that sheep farm so you don't have to keep on getting wool all the time. And I did indeed wrangle up some sheep and put them over here in this little area over here. And, uh, oh, wow, some of them actually grew back their wool already. Don't mind if I be shearing you. There we go. We're having ourselves a pretty good amount of wool. And we're going to need this wool because I also got comments saying that we should use the Mr. Crayfish, uh, couches for the Twin Emeralds Hotel. So let's definitely do that. And I don't know how much wool we have right now. Uh, we do have 17 right now, but I don't know how much we have in like in general. Let's just uh, let's just see how many we have right now actually uh, Wool, let's just type in wool and 26 in total and plus this one light gray as well So 27 plus 17. That's not bad the 44. I think that's not bad for 44 wool uh, We're gonna need six for one couch block itself. So we're probably going to need an absolute ton of wool <laughs> Let's go over here and see if any more of these yeah, yep. 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 There we go. They want to be multiplied. No problem We still have some little lambs over here that need to grow up though. So hopefully all oh, that door is open. No, 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 no Woo! Oh, you better get back in there. Oof. Okay. Let's 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 open up the gate and we do a little bit of this. There we go Come on, come on, do- Oh, there's chickens and sheep escaping right now. This is awful. This is terrible. Oh, man. Okay, well, I can't kill them. Or else the T-Rexes will just freak out and just kill the whole entire world with lag. So, oh, I guess I'll be shearing these sheep. Oh, I guess we're like one or two sheep short now. Hashtag two sheep short. Uh, well, anyways, we have 22 wool right now. And what was it, like 27 or so? 20 six inside of here so let's just uh grab ourselves some wool so 27 and we should be able to make a pretty decent amount of these couches eight couches not bad and i guess uh throughout the episode hopefully these sheep are gonna you know grow their wool back and we get even more wool so and speaking of wool we do have wool that we can just get from the mr or the uh the regular couches over here because they're just carpenter blocks let's go over here see how many we can get and, uh, yeah, yeah, two there, and it's just one wool per block, which is way more efficient than the six wool per block that we need for the Mr. Crayfish thing, so... Ah, it's, it's kind of unfortunate that we have to spend so much wool just to get these fancy-looking couches, but ah, I guess it's kind of worth it here in the end. I also got some comments saying that we should, like, use the Mr. Crayfish, uh, chair for this, so I, I don't know if I want to do that. Hmm... Like, I am, I am pretty proud of this chair, and it, it really does blend in with the, the jungle and the acacia we have going on over here, so... I don't know if I want to change that. Hmm, leave, leave a comment down below. Should we change this now to, like, a, a regular stone chair or a regular uh, wooden chair for Mr. Crayfish? Or, or keep this over here with the acacia and the, and the jungle wood we've got going on. It really, really fits the whole entire atmosphere and the actual table as well. I, I really like it like that, so I want to know what you guys think. Anyways... We have eight couch blocks we can use. Uh, ooh, I probably shouldn't have broke all the couches. But uh, I think the main couch was like this. Like the width of the th of the main window like that. Man, that's huge. Whew, that is expensive. And then we had another couch like here, right? I don't know if we did or not. Hmm. Hmm, yeah, I think we had like a two-wide couch there. I don't know if this one was that wide, though. If, it, if that's the case, yeah, we can just keep it like this. And put this like that. Yeah, 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 and then we can have another couch right there, and we just need to put another one, like, right there, and that's good. Yeah, yeah, we don't have to have it, like, curl in like that. And why does that look so nasty? <laughs> Alright, let's just place it back down. There you go. Yeah, it looks really good. I, I think it really looks really good. Maybe just a three-wide couch is good enough? Yeah, three-wide couch isn't even that bad. It's, it's still pretty big. And, of course, with that extra wool, we just put another 
two couch right there or like a love seat i think that's like a technical term for a you know love seat and then uh we have one extra couch in our inventory right now so we just put that there and we need to go grab ourselves some lime green dye and we need to just get uh, a decent amount of that so we can you know lime dye the the couches you know green so they match the emerald theme we have going on also we got some comments saying that i should make a wireless you should probably you probably saw it whenever i opened up my inventory but i should get a wireless terminal for our me network we've got going on here you know really broaden it up you know make it so we can access it from pretty much anywhere as long as we have the a wireless signal to us so i thought you know why not i've been looking at recipes for stuff i'd need for it and i'm pretty sure we're able to pretty sure we're able to afford it no problem so first of all i think what we need is a security terminal security so i think we need to make one of those first so there you go and we need an emmy chest which is decently expensive uh, a little bit of glass another terminal and uh yeah i'm pretty sure we can afford that no problem we do need a 16k uh thing which isn't that expensive if we have all the things already made. I might have to do a little bit of that off camera because it is pretty repetitive. And let's actually see what we have for our materials. Uh, hmm. Let's look at the recipe again. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure I can make it as long as I do it off camera and, you know, just do it real quick. Because we do. I think we have all the materials we need. If not, then, you know, I can easily make them real quick because we have a lot of diamond uh, circuits there. A lot of gold circuits and a lot of those pure pure source quartz crystal circuits there as well so we just need to combine those together and we already have some pre-made ones right there as well and of course a lot of silicon actually we need more silicon so <laughs> probably have to do that as well anyways pretty sure we're able to afford it no problem engineering processor yeah we literally already have one of those right there and then these just 16k things which just take a million years because they're just so repetitive you have to keep making them over and over again and after that we need to make a wireless access point or something like that wireless let's go back to wireless search and we need a wireless receiver and we're going to need two of those which is a flux pearl which is basically flux dust flux crystals or a pure flux crystal surrounding an ender pearl and i'm pretty sure we have a lot of ender pearls ender pearls yeah there you go a lot of ender pearls right there not bad at all uh 22 yeah pretty good amount and for the what else do we need we need to make two of those things then we need the actual wireless access point yeah there you go and we just need a calculation processor with a glass cable which we already have a calculation processor like right there and uh, glass cables yeah it looks like we just need to make more of those but you can make them easy peasy no problem with these quartz fibers and i think just regular glass i think i think that's pretty much all you really need and then to boost the wireless signal we need these boosters which is pretty cheap ender dust that's going to be the most expensive thing because i think you have to pulverize ender pearls you know you only get one per pulverized ender pearls and i don't think our ender pearls down here are doing too well i don't even think they're even grown right let's let's check let's go down here and check with this nasty lag that's going on right now i don't know why it's doing that 14 yeah still 14 percent for all these i don't know why it's, it's really weird I, I, you'd think it'd at least go up from that, and it's been like well over a week, so <laughs> I don't know why they haven't gone up at all. Either way, uh, we should be able to afford all those things, so I think what I'm going to do is try to build the, what is it called, the security terminal? Try and build that off camera, and I think the other things are cheap enough to where we can just make those on camera. So I'm just going to go make the security terminal real quick, and I'll see you guys here in a bit. Alright guys, so we're back, and we can pretty much make it like right now actually okay never mind i was about to say like, <laughs> uh, i thought i was able to auto craft that but i guess not uh oh i think i need one more no i have the diamond thing right there why will not auto craft this let's actually get the recipe on the screen uh there's that uh there's the glass uh, i have the 16k thing right there there's the me chest oh i need one more iron you kidding me there's one more iron ingot that's the thing that we're holding us back uh iron ingot uh, yeah, we don't have any more iron ingots. We have to actually use iron blocks for all that. So let's put out all of there. Get ourselves one block of iron, turn it like that, and there we go. Emmy security terminal thing. All right, so I guess we just, I don't know. I don't know, throw it there. <laughs> throw it there. And there we go. There's the security terminal. So next, what we need to do is make the wireless, wireless receiver. So, or like two of these things yeah wireless emitter things yeah wireless receiver so we're going to need two of those we need to get the flux pearl and you need to get two ender pearls and flux dust along with flux crystals so uh, i think we're going to need to throw some more of the charged crystals inside of here like so 
There you go. Hopefully that gets me more of the- There you go, more of the purple. I'm, I'm making myself a pure Surus Quartz in there right now. So that's why we have someone in there just uh, charging up. And uh, what's going on inside of here? Why are these lights going from like amber to green? Maybe it's like moving items away from other ones and going into other ones to be more efficient, maybe? I don't know. Priority. Oh, yeah, that's for other stuff. Oof. <laughs> don't want to mess with that just yet. Anyways, uh, for these wireless receiver, yeah, yeah, we need to get some ender pearls. Ender pearls, we need to grab a few of those. Uh, how much fluix dust do we need? I think four each, right? Yeah, four each, so you need to throw some more of that inside of there. That's one dust each, right? Yeah, one dust each. Ooh, one, two, three, four. And we're going to need five more of these. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. And... All right, give us more of those purple crystal, Hada. There we go. <laughs> and we should have enough dust. There we go. And see if we can actually auto-craft this thing now. And there we go, Flux Pearl, and what am I missing on the sides? More dust? Yeah, there you go. <laughs> so we have two of those dust things. Uh, we can put that up, back up inside. Actually, Flux, it went inside of here. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> and oh yeah, we had glass in here? Man, I made glass. Man, I need to put all my stuff back over to this chest for the ME terminal stuff. Anyways, wireless receiver, we should be able to make that right now. There's that, and what was the recipe for that again? Uh that on the screen yeah there you go so we need that and we need the eyeball and a little bit of iron there you go so we have two of the receivers we need one of them for the actual this thing the wireless terminal itself and we need another one for the wireless ac access port which you need the calculation processor which i'm pretty sure we have one of those at least if not then we can make one no problem easily like for real quick man my inventory is full of stuff because i had to craft a bunch of stuff uh, yeah, I don't think we have one, but we can just throw... Yeah, we have enough stuff. Yep, right inside there. Silicon and redstone. All right, and that'll get us one of those. And what else? We'll need another ME terminal, so I can make that real quick with the extra annihilation things I had to make, because I had to make a terminal for the security thing, so there's that. Oh, I guess I have to make another, uh, no? I should be able to make it right now, right? Uh, let's get that on the screen. There we go. Oh, it didn't have the Illuminate thing. The Illuminate thing was actually in the chest next to the thing, so let's put that in there. There's the Emmy Terminal. There's that calculation thing. Man, this is so repetitive. Now you guys know why I have most of this off, off camera, because <laughs> it's just so repetitive. Anyways, uh, for the wireless terminal itself, we also need a dense energy cell, which is an energy cell surrounded like eight of these things. Yeah, we're going to need a lot of this dust. <laughs> so we're going to need to put, uh, I don't know. Jeez, I don't know. Oh, wow, the pur pure, is, is that done? Are these done? Pure source course crystals? Yeah, they're done. Nice. <laughs> this is throw them inside the chest just in case we need them later. Anyways, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And I don't know. I'll just throw all these in there, right? <laughs> Might as well. Might as well get as much as we can forward, right? And that's a lot of purple. 24. Not bad. Not bad at all. And we should be able to... Oh, yeah. We already had fluid crystals in our inventory. I don't know why I did that. Uh, what was I making? This? Uh, no, 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 I need to make this thing, which you need these energy cells, which you need 4 times 8, which is 32 pulverized, uh, dust. So let's get that inside of there, let that pulverize. We can start clearing our inventory of all this extra garbage we're not using right now, so let's put it all up there like that. And we should be able to make the wireless access port right now, right? Yeah, yeah, we should be able to. Yeah, let's do that real quick. And, why is it not? No, oh, it's because that other part is in here. And wireless access port, there we go. Alright, so there's the wireless access port. We should be able to put that, pff, I don't know, put that on the security terminal, why not? <laughs> and right there is where we're going to link up the wireless terminal itself. And we also need these booster things if we want to get ourselves a pretty good range. So, uh, charged service course or regular service course, as well as more fluid dust. Jeez. Uh, let's put 24 up there. I don't know how much these boosters boost the signal. Maybe like one block each booster or something. But we're going to get a pretty good amount of them. And hopefully we won't really need any more of them. Since we don't really need uh, leave the general area that we're always in. So we don't really need it to be too, too powerful. Uh, what were we doing? Oh yeah, making the little energy storage things. Uh, I need to make more of this quartz glass, I think. Uh, why can I not make these energy things? Uh, oh, I think, yeah, I need these crystals. Yeah, there you go. Get the... I don't want to use the pure source quartz. Do I have any regular source quartz? Oh yeah, I have straight up blocks of this stuff. Jeez. <laughs> there you go. And I think we just need more of this quartz glass as well. And how do you make that? Uh, pulverized quartz. Uh, didn't I have a lot of that? Yeah, I do. But I also need regular glass. Yep, here we go. Let's make some more of that. There you go. Pretty good amount. Nine now. Not bad. 
And we should be able to make these like so. So we can make six of them right there. Uh, what are we missing to make more of them? Uh, we have we have enough dust, obviously. We just need to get two of them. And it looks like we just need more... Uh, yeah, just more crystals. Alright, well, I guess I'll just break down that block again. Might as well. Uh, where'd I put it? Oh, there it is. Get ourselves even more of these crystals. Jeez. And one and two. There we go. So we have eight energy cells. And then we need to surround a calculation processor with that. So let's get one of that. Silicon and redstone. Where's the redstone? Oh, yeah, we spent all the redstone. Let's go grab some redstone dust. And let's press that inside of here. And man, this is way more complicated than I thought it was. <laughs> uh, we should also be getting our ender pearls. Uh, we have four ender pearls left. Oh wait, no, I have 16 in my inventory. Uh, how much do we want to crush though? Maybe eight? Maybe just eight. We can get like eight boosters and see how far that takes us in range, you know? Hopefully it takes us pretty far. And we should be able to make this now. Really? You can't make it? You can't make it yet? Why can't I not make it yet? Calculation processor. I don't know why it's not letting me do it, but I guess I'll just do it manually. And there you go, dense energy cell. And we should be able to craft this now. That, that, and the dense energy cell. And there's the wireless terminal. And we should be able to link that up to a security thing. Like so. So it's linked now, and we have a an energetic infuser, so we can just charge it up like so. I don't know how much this holds. Was that 1.6 million? Yeah, 1.6 million, uh... I'd say RF, but it's like an energinistics energy, applied energinistics energy, you know, so hopefully that's going to charge up pretty well. And uh, what are we waiting on? Oh yeah, the ender pearls, and we need to make some of these boosters, so there we go. Uh, what are we missing? More iron? Yep, <laughs> more iron. Let's get some iron blocks, and thus turn those into ingots. So let's get uh, 27, that should be way more than enough. And we should be able to get uh, 8, 6, oh yeah, 16 boost. okay, it makes 2 at a time. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, let's do it. 16 boosters installed into here. Actually, six, 16 meters. Ah, uh, yeah, it's too short. And what if we put one inside there? Yeah, it looks like it's just one block. No, that one did it 1.8 blocks. So what if we have all 16 of them? 80 meters. 80 meters. That's, that's a lot. And this is completely full now. Okay. So 80 meters. And this is linked up. Let's see if it works. Uh, whoops. Oh, it worked. Yeah, it works. Wireless terminal. Oh, look at that, it works! And then I can just type in, uh, I don't know, iron? Type in iron, and I can grab an iron hammer. Take that out, no problem. Oh, this is fantastic! How much How much energy does it take? No, it doesn't take that much energy. We're at 99.82% right now. That's like nothing! Wow! Okay, we'll see if we have any, uh, I don't know. Green dye, yep, cactus green. Uh, what about cactus? Uh, yeah, we don't have any cactus. Uh, what about, uh, bone meal? Uh, I guess not. Geez, I'll just grab regular bones. Uh, unfortunately, it doesn't have the crafting terminal inside of this. That would have been like a million times greater than it already is. But uh, let's just grab some bones, get ourselves some bone meal, so we can turn this into lime dye, like so. There we go. Ten lime dye. How much do we need? I think we might need a little bit more than that, so let's actually go over here. And uh, actually, how much wool do I have? Yeah, I have even more wool right now, because I did uh, shear some of the sheep while making the security terminal, so let's actually make ourselves some more of those beds. Or, uh, not beds. The sofas. There we go. I don't know how many I'll need, so I'll just get, I don't know, three. <laughs> I also got some comments saying that I should move the, the Christmas tree downstairs into Dr. Indominus' uh, little area, his little apartment down here, or maybe even down here, you know? I got some comments saying to put it down there. I don't think, yeah, I don't think there's really, eh. You probably put it, like, right there. But the thing is, I don't think you can move those presents. I think if you break them, that opens them, and I don't know if you get the present back. We might have to craft the present again if we want to move them, so I think we're just going to leave it right here. And uh, I got some comments saying that this is like my house, even though it's not really my house. I did mention a while ago saying that I'm going to be moving into the penthouse there, all the way up there. We're probably going to decorate that next episode or something. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. Anyways, let's see what we have inside of here. Uh, that's done. Okay, yeah, I, I made one extra sofa. I didn't mean to make more. There we go. And I think it looks pretty good right now. Not bad at all. Let's actually get our lime dye out and start dyeing this stuff. So there we go. That looks fantastic. Not bad at all. Wow, this is looking really good. I'm really liking how it looks right now. It, like the sofas, they look way better. They actually have like sofa arms instead of just random half blocks that go out the side, you know? It actually looks really, really good. Oh, wow, we're one die short. Are you kidding me? I think I accidentally dyed one of the couches twice, so sour about that. Anyways. 
Let's get ourselves some cactus. Go throw it inside of the furnaces real quick. Combine it with bone meal and we'll be good to go. All right, so I, I'd say we got a pretty good amount of progress done today. I'm really, really happy about that wireless terminal that we have. It's absolutely fantastic. It's going to come in so handy here in the future. Uh, put that up. Yeah, put the wool up. And let's actually get the bone meal. Oh, there we go. There's the bone meal. Now let's prep that for the cactus green. There we go. And let's go finish dying that last couch, shall we? Let's go do it real quick. Hey, how's it going, Dr. Domus? You, uh, you really like your apartment over there? Why do you have two of these... Mailbox, I'm pretty sure I broke the extra one I made, didn't I? Pretty sure I did, I don't know why there's two of them there. <laughs> Maybe it glitched out or something, who knows? Anyways, let's go die that last couch real quick, and I think we'll be good to go. Next episode, as I planned, I'm, I'm definitely planning on decorating my room or house or whatever you want to call it up there at the penthouse. We can probably go visit that real quick. And let's go die that. There we go. Looking good. And let the sliding glass door open, no problem. Go up to floor 122, because that is the penthouse. That's going to be our room. That's going to... Oh, yeah. Uh, I didn't work on the apartment. Or uh, not the apartment. I didn't work on the hotel at all since uh, since I last updated you guys. So these are all still all the exact same. They haven't been decorated or anything on the inside. Whenever I do decorate the actual hotel rooms, I, I plan on just decorating one. Oh, no, I'm stuck. Oh, we're going down to 97. Oof. And go up to 122. Oof. <laughs> Hopefully it doesn't glitch out and kill me next time. Anyways, uh, I do plan on just decorating one room and then, uh, you know, one one regular room. And then later I'll decorate one, like, mid-tier room. You know, just so I can, uh, you know, do the rest of them on my own. And I don't end up doing all the rooms on camera and waste a bunch of time when I'm, they're all just going to be the same anyways. So, this is a really good space up here. As I said earlier, I haven't worked on it at all. So, actually, you know what? Wireless terminal. Let's grab some acacia wood, shall we? <laughs> this wireless terminal is going to be so handy as I'm talking about. Like, look at this. Whenever we're, whenever we're working on our, uh, like, decorating our penthouse from here, we can just access literally all of our items. No problem up here. Man. I'm actually surprised it's able to reach all the way up here, like... 80 blocks? I don't know if that, I don't know if it vertically, I don't know if it counts vertically or not, but pretty sure we're more than 80 blocks away if, we're, if it's also counting vertical blocks, so, man, this is insane that it's reaching all the way over here. But yeah, this, this wireless terminal is going to be absolutely fantastic for building and uh, finishing up and doing doing the tweaking, the last tweaking here on the uh, Twin Emeralds Hotel here in the future, just to kind of finalize it, make it look really perfect for the grand opening here. I'm, I'm really excited for the grand opening, whatever that's going to be. It's, it's going to look absolutely fantastic. Anyways... That's going to be me for right now, so thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. Let me know what you guys think about this wireless terminal. It's absolutely fantastic. How much energy do we have? Still at 99%. You kidding me? You kidding me? And it, it seems like it only uses it whenever you're actually, uh, yeah, whenever you're actually inside the inventory, so it's not really, like, wasting any power right now, but or whenever we are using it. Yeah, it does go down decently quick, but it does have one point. 1.7 or 1.6 million RF inside of it, so don't really matter. Anyways, let me know what you guys think about this wireless terminal. It's absolutely great, in my opinion. And, uh, yeah. Next time, we're going to work on the penthouse up here, you know, decorating it, make it look really, really good. And, of course, I want to make the roof with the, the jacuzzis and the private pool and stuff like that. That's going to be absolutely fantastic. That's going to be next time, so thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. I'll put my latest videos on our YouTube homepage as soon as they come out so you don't miss an episode. But until then, thank you guys all for watching, and I'll see you guys here next time. Oh, bye there. Oh, whoa. I'm right-clicking with the... <laughs> I'm right-clicking with the, the Annihilator. Uh, uh, not the Annihilator, that's End of Earth. I'm right-clicking with the Manolin Cleaver right now, and I have, like, four arms. I'm blocking with it. I have four arms, so the, so the power suit arms are, like, acting like I'm holding a bow. But my actual arms are actually holding it like I'm blocking with the sword. What is going on right now? <laughs> Anyways, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time. I've got four arms. Watch out for me.